guys, so today we're going to be doing the power of makeup tag. This was originally by Nikki Tutorials, I believe, and she did an amazing job at it. So what it is, is you do half of your face full on glam makeup, so you can see the difference between no makeup and makeup. Makeup is a super powerful thing, and you should never be ashamed to wear it, because it's fun. And really... The only reason I wear makeup is because it's fun. I don't do it for anyone else. I do it for me. And that's how it should be for anyone. So first, I'm gonna take my green corrector and go over any spots that need color correction. And then I'm gonna blend it out with my beauty blender. And then we're gonna go in with our foundation. I am using the Femme Couture. Couture, Couture, the Femme Couture. Um, you get this at Sally's Beauty Supply. This is Flawless 8-in-1 Foundation, and this is Light Medium. And I really like this stuff, because it really does give you like a flawless foundation set. Take my Beauty Blender and blend all of that out. And this is my favorite by far out of any concealers that I've tried ever so far, um, and I've tried a lot. This is Pro Longwear Concealer by MAC, and this is NC20. This is bomb stuff. This stuff is amazing. And then we're going to set everywhere that we just put that foundation with a fluffy brush. And then we're going to go in with some more translucent powder with a sponge and just pack that underneath your eye. This is called cooking or baking. And this is just gonna sit while we finish the rest of our makeup. This helps with creasing of your concealer and making your makeup last longer, like all throughout the night. And then we're gonna go in with whatever you're priming your eye with. This is a paint pot by MAC and this is Soft Ochre. We're gonna put that all over our lid. All right, and then we're gonna go in with a eyeshadow color that is close to your skin tone just to set what we just put on our lid. This is for more of the beginners in makeup. This helps you blend out your eyeshadows easier. And then we get into the good stuff. So. I usually go in with whatever color transitional color I want to go in to my crease with. So today that's going to be Saddle by MAC. It's a really pretty brownish red color. Alright, so since we're going for a full glam look here, I'm actually going to use this gold color. It's called Posh and this is by the TG palette. Going in with that gold wet. All right, and then we're gonna go in with a darker brown. And this is Mystery by MAC. We're gonna put that into our crease, but not blend as high as we did with Saddle. Then after that, we're just gonna go into right underneath our brow arch with Vanilla by MAC. And then we are going to go in with our crease brush again and go in with a tiny, tiny bit of black. Right here from the Chi palette again. This one's called Black. Imagine that. <laughs> and then we're going to go in and pop just a tiny bit of that champagne color, which was that really pretty, sparkly, beigey color. We're going to pop that right into our tear duct area. All right, and then we're going to go in with Anastasia Dip Brow in Ash Brown, I believe, yes, um, with a angled brush, and we are going to carve out our brow. And, and then we're gonna go in and do our eyeliner. Now, to make the eye look like it's popping and open more, I'm just gonna do a wing, and then kind of just wing it in the corner, inner corner of your eye, just a tiny bit, and that will help tremendously. Once you're done with that, you're going to go in 
and curl your eyelashes and apply your falsies. Then we are going to smoke out the bottom lash line. We're gonna go in and shape our face however we wanna shape it. Contouring and highlighting is amazing at what a difference it makes before and after your makeup is done. Really shape the face. So we're gonna go through our cheekbones or the hollows of our cheeks, cheekbones, under our cheekbones, then underneath our jawline and around the temples and the top of the forehead. All right, so for highlighting, I'm gonna go in with two products. One is Shell from MAC, this is a cream product. And then I'm gonna go over that with Silver Dusk by MAC, and this is a powder product. We're going to line and fill in with the red color by Milani, and this is number two in True Red. And then we're going to take a little bit of that champagne color that from the Chi palette on our finger and just dot a tiny bit on the bottom of our lips and rub together. Just so you guys know, I feel completely comfortable with no makeup on just as much as I do with makeup on. It doesn't matter. You should feel beautiful no matter what you are wearing. You gotta be happy with the skin that you're in. All right, so that was the Power of Makeup tag. Again, Nuki Tutorials came out with it before a while ago, and I wanted to do it back then, but I just didn't have time, so here it is. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please, please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Beauty by Josie K, and follow me on all of my other social networks, such as Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and now Periscope. They're also at Beauty by Josie K on all of them, and yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I love you all. Bye.